and I am from Renovation Solutions India Private Limited. In this video, I am going to explain about a college management software. First of all, what is college management? What is the use of it? Is it necessary to use college management? If it is necessary, how to use it? Everyone have all the questions like above. In this video, I am going to clear all your doubts. Then without any delay, let's get on to the video. A college management system enables colleges and higher education to manage enrollment, admissions, students, faculty, attendance, fees, etc. of the institute. It generates automated reports on all aspects for data-driven decision making. Colleges need to pursue the digital transformation trend which helped other industries like banking, manufacturing, commerce, corporate organizations to improve their operational efficiency. Still transformation benefits the colleges in multiple ways like saving time of faculty, storing and analyzing the academic and administrative data, engaging the students through encouraging digital culture, improving communication, etc. Digital transformation in colleges is achieved by implementing a college management system. This helps us to manage the entire college activities. First, we have login page. In that, we can log into that with proper details. After login, we have various purposes of college management is separated based on their use. We can find that that is dashboard, student, parents, teacher, user, academic, attendance, exam, mock, etc. Now, I'm going to explain one by one in detail. First, when we enter into the dashboard, we can find that we have number of students, parents, teacher, subjects, and all the details will be appeared in the dashboard. And also we can see that account summary, that is uh, income and expense. And if we move down, we can have notices that we are giving in the college. If you want, we can edit this and uh, we can send to the parents and teachers. Next, we have student. In student, we can find the details of the students based on their classes. Here we have, we added three, four classes that is BTEC, BTEC 2, BTEC 3 and BTEC 4. If we select one of that, we can find the students of that particular class. And uh, if we have any new student, we can add with the add a student. This is about the student. When we move to parents, here we can find the sum of parents that we added for the students in the student column. And if you want to add a new parent, you can add uh, in add a parent option. If you want to edit a parent, we can edit uh, their details also. Next, move to the teacher. In teacher, we can find the sim uh, same similarly that we found in the parents. Here, we can add a new teacher if uh, there is a new teacher. And these uh, teachers are the teachers which are uh, which we have added the classes. We can have their email ID and uh, what is the status of the teacher. And if you want to edit anything, we can edit that and we can add a new teacher also. Next user, that means who are using this. Next, if you move to academic, we can find uh, uh, class, section, subject, syllabus, assignment, routine. In class, we can see the classes that we added here. If you want to add a new class, we can add and we can edit or delete the present classes also. And the teacher also, we had to add. The, the we added in the teacher column, we had to add the teacher that which class they are belong to. And in section, we had to select a particular class and we have to see the section. In BTEC, there is A and ACE or the sections. If you select BTEC 2, here CSE, CEA that added uh, this. If you want to add a new section, we can add here. In subject, 
same in section we have to select the class and we have to see the subjects of the particular class like b tech 2 like this if you want to add a new subject we can add that in syllabus also same for the subjects we added in the class we can found the syllabus assignment means that we are giving an assignment uh, the, what, what is the title of that assignment and description deadline when we have to complete that and uh, which section we are giving that uh, all the details will be appeared in the assignment routine means um, all the daily routine like uh, monday which class uh, up to this time like that every day we can add the routine next in attendance we can find student attendance teacher and user attendance if you want to see the student attendance we can select the class and we can see the particular student of that class whether he is present or not on that particular day similarly for teacher and user also in exam we have exam exam schedule grade exam attendance in exam we have we can add uh, what exams we have to for the students we can i added here mid exam if you want you can add some more exams that we are giving to the students and exam schedule that is when will be the exam and uh, date which subject we are going to and time where we are conducting the room number and etc all the things will be appeared in the exam schedule column in grade that means uh, after the completion of exam based on their mocks we are giving the grade for which mocks uh, they got the grade points and mocks that is mock uh, what we added what we have to give the grade we can add here in exam attendance uh, the students who presented uh, during the exam they will be shown here in mock mark mark distribution and promotion in mocks we can see mocks uh, that the student got in the in a particular exam and mock says there is distributor or not if it is that student is promoted or not this will be found in the mark message in message we can see here uh, that uh, that we are uh, conversation with the parents teacher and students Mm, and in media media is nothing but we can we can know that uh, what the gallery or videos that uh, have that are related to our college management we can hear we can post here and in mail in mail we can found that the mails that we are sent for uh, parents student and teacher can be found here that is that means that we are uh, giving any that we are giving any um, information to the students we can go through the mail those mails will be found here if you want to add a mail we can add a mail and send to the parents or teacher or admin who, whomever we want in online exam in online exam we have question group question level question bank online exam instruction take exam uh, same uh, when we are conducting an online exam what should be what uh, should we have to be like question group what type of uh, questions they are and question level question bank their answers and uh, online exam and the instructions for the online exam and if you want to write the exam take exam these are the these are found in online exam and payroll payroll is nothing but uh, that is related to money uh, if you are paying a salary uh, that uh, salary template for a particular teacher how much salary it would be and hourly template means uh, it for for an hour how much salary we are giving to a particular teacher all the information will be found here if you want to manage a salary either decrease or increase we can manage that and uh, if you want to make a payment we can make a payment next we can see asset management asset management uh, is nothing but that uh, it is a finance term that means uh, 
रेफरेंस टू इंडिविजुअल्स और फंड्स दैट मैनेज एसेट्स ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ ऑल इंडिविजुअल और अदर एंटिटीज दैट हुम वी आर पेइंग एंड द लोकेशन व्हाट वी आर परचेसिंग एक्सेट्रा ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन विल बी फाउंड इन एसेट मैनेजमेंट लाइक वेन दर वी हुम वी आर पेइंग द मनी एंड व्हाट इज द एसेट वी बॉट एंड द लोकेशन ऑफ दैट व्हाट वी परचेस्ड ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन कैन बी फाउंड इन एसेट मैनेजमेंट नेक्स्ट इन्वेंट्री इन इन्वेंट्री वी कैन सी the information about the money we invested like purchasing a product category of product who supplied it and selling information etc all the information can be found in the inventory next leave application leave application is leave category leave assign leave apply leave application uh in leave category that means uh, what type of leave we are taking and we are assigning the leave or not if you want to apply leave we can select up leave apply if we want to if we want a leave application we can select it the leave entire information about leave can be found here next we are moving to child in child activities category activities and child care in library that is the number of members and books issue e books uh, that in books we have number of books that are presented in the library and how many books are issued to a particular student and e books some of them want uh, e books they can also bought from the library those details are found in the library next transport in transport we can find transport and member uh, in transport uh, if you are if you are transporting the uh, i mean moving uh, children are moving to their home those are transport and uh, who how many children are moving and uh, where the destination all the information related to transport will be found here next in hostel hostel category and member uh, if you want to see a particular person in a hostel uh, what type of category he is staying and uh, the name of the student all the information related to hostel will be found in the hostel account in account we have fee types fee voucher payment history expense income global payment account means that is uh, uh, income and expenses and fee type fee voucher and the payment history whether he paid or he paid fee or not all the information related to the fee can be found in the account announcement announcement is nothing but if you are giving any announcement like a notice event or any holiday those will be uh, found in the announcement next report report is nothing but if you have any report like related to class or student or id card admit card routine report all the reports will be found in the report if you want to report anything we can report like uh, library books report library card report all the all the information related to report next online admission if you have any online admission we can enter here and we can be found whenever we want visitor information it is nothing but uh, when a visitor wants to see his children the information related to them will be feed before itself if when when they can we can uh, easily found the student and uh, administrator administrator means academic year student group complaint certificate template system admin reset password these are all uh, related to administrator who are administrating this uh, if, if we are if now 2020 we can add academic year of that and uh, student group and if you have any complaint we can add uh, all the information related to administrator will be found here if you want to update anything we can update here next front end front end means that we have to appear in the front end uh, like a post pages menu that uh, we have to uh, in our college management what will be appeared in the front, front end all will be posted here and we can see the changes of there 
next settings if you want to change anything like general setting if you want to change anything in the front end front end setting in payment setting also if you want to add or delete some of the columns we can do here in the settings sms setting email setting all the things